Good morning, YouTubers, and welcome to the spinning vlog. If this makes you sick, then be sick. <laughs> um, ooh, dizzy. Uh, it is uh, Tuesday, July 14th. I'm just compressing the finishing up touches for yesterday's vlog. Uh, it is 20 after 8 o'clock in the morning, and I uh, drove, had to get up at 7 just before seven and drive Megan to work. Uh, she's working for the Pan Am Games and uh, luckily there's an event that's happening really close to our house. So it's like called skeet shooting where you shoot the clay pigeons. <laughs> like duck hunt. Uh, so as you can see, it's nice and hot and sunny right now, but they're calling for severe thunderstorms and stuff later on. So uh, I'm pretty, tired today from my bike ride I did yesterday, but I don't feel sore, which is a good thing. That means I'm all my muscles are where they're supposed to be. I just need more of this exercise because I'm still too heavy. Uh, I need to lose a good 10, 20 pounds. That's how much I need to lose. Because uh, we're doing a rock climbing trip in September and I'd like to definitely be 20 pounds lighter so it makes it easier to climb. And uh, it's easy to do. You just don't eat as much, exercise more. That's so easy. Um, let me know in the comments below if you're struggling with eating too much food and not enough exercise. I try, but this is my job and I have to eat to entertain you. Uh, I don't, yeah, I don't have to eat crap food all the time. It's true. But uh, anyway, so. Um, yeah, I'm gonna start editing this vlog. As you can see, my compressor is done. So now I have to zip over to Final Cut Pro, import those footage, import those footage, and uh, we'll get busy. Once I've finished the vlog, upload that. Uh, at this point in time, I'm actually uploading the last gaming episode I have for uh, editing, ed stuff that I've edited and shot. It's my last episode of that. I had to shoot more, make some more gaming videos. Um, but that's going up right now. They'll be up at 10. I just had to finish editing, editing this and put it up. It'll be up by nine. And then I have to edit um, the video for tonight, which is the Dawn Air video. And that will be up tonight. Oh my gosh, I'm so tired. Okay, off to work. All right, I finished the uh, Dawn Air Halifax original on air uh, video I try really hard to get it done by 12 and I kind of kept tinkering with it and I kept somebody actually sent me the link to uh, two videos uh, and I couldn't find the email I went through all my social media trying to find the person who originally sent me where to go uh, I did put about 12 maybe 14 people um, kind of give them all little shout outs with their uh, either their their channel icon or like all the people in the past uh, who've asked me to do donair just you know just randomly went through and grabbed a bunch of people put them in I did uh, shout out I think his name was Gardner and it could be Gardner like no I don't know how to spell it. Anyway, I kind of remember that part of the email and I remember and I did click on it and I think I did it when I was at the cottage on my holiday, but I couldn't find the email and I hate that. And I even did a search, did a search under name. I did a search under Don Air uh, in the subject line or in the entire email address, like just everything. And I could not find the person. So I apologize, whoever that is. Anyway, so we're off to Barry. Uh, it turns out there's a few people whose disc two for some reason doesn't work on one of the dance studios that I shot. So I had to make a few replacements. And uh, so I'm driving them up there right now. And I'm gonna get some water while I'm up there. And uh, oh, and I, did, I just finished shooting a gaming video, I guess episode 37. Uh, we got the achievement of return to sender. That's when you hit basically a, a missile back to a ghast. And again, any of you who don't 
play Minecraft, that doesn't mean anything to you. Anyway, so when the monster shoots a bomb at me and I hit it and it goes right back and kills him, then I get an award. <laughs> so, uh, and then I got to build the, the diamond block uh, monument, which is good. Anyway, so like I said, we're up to going up to Barry and uh, I'm going rock climbing tonight, but we're probably doing like a 7.30 climb because I have to pick Megan up at 6.30 and then I'll go rock climbing. Let's go to Barry. Just finished uh, dropping off the DVDs to Dance Incorporated and now it's the rain has started. And it's that really heavy, heavy rain and then it just stops. And then my windshield wipers go. All right, we're off to get water <laughs> in the rain. All right, we're up at the uh, water depot. I got four jugs to fill. And uh, I do get a lot of uh, comments every once in a while. Uh, you know, what, you have to buy your water? Because we're on a well system and most of the time the well is in really good condition and you can drink out of it no problem but every once in a while well water you gotta you gotta keep testing your water all the time and if there's been a few times where it comes back where it's like e borderlining on whether you should drink it or not so that's why we buy our water just to be extremely safe we cook and everything with our well water but we just don't drink it like a big glass of water you know what i'm saying all right let me get this done and i think i'm going to go over to um, Canada Computers and check out to see if I can get myself a Drobo. I think we have to order it because they don't carry it in stock. Got the water. Now we're heading into Canada Computers. Let's see how long it will take to get my Drobo. Well, they don't sell the uh, the Drobo f 5N, but I don't need that one because that's just a network one. I want the uh, um, what's it called? Thunderbolt. It's pouring, that's why I'm waiting. Uh, but it's $949 for the Drobo 5D. So I'm gonna look for it online in other places and I might actually see if I can buy it when I'm down in the States. I'm gonna be down in the States three times and if I could buy it there and bring it back, that would be probably the best. So I'm gonna see if I can make it to the car. I don't mind if the camera gets a little wet, let's go. Holy schmoly! Uh. We are in the car, people! No. All right. I'm singing in the rain, hey! Okay, so now it's uh, home time, and then research time. Might have to do another uh, gaming video just to get ahead of the game. <laughs> okay, let's go. I am on my way to pick up Megan. Uh, she's finishing up work earlier, which is good. It's uh, 527. So she's gonna be finishing about 15 minutes as opposed to, or quarter to six as opposed to 630. So like 45 minutes early. Um, so I did a bike ride. I just went out for a quick one because the rain has been raining like crazy up in, in Barrie and it's starting to come here now just as we're speaking but uh, I needed to uh, get another bike ride in before I went rock climbing. I wanted to burn a few more calories so I ended up um, really really hauling ass on this ride so I burned like 400 calories in just over 30 minutes and I almost averaged 30 kilometers per hour which is where you want to be 30 plus that's where you want to be as a cyclist that's where I want to be and I, and I you, you get that little edge of, of respect when you're like that 30 plus uh, for me anyway guys that's don't compare yourself to anybody else I just this is my own little world if I'm doing 30 kilometers an hour averaging that I'm extremely happy I burn a lot of calories lots of energy coming out of those legs so uh, yeah I, I, it's funny because I stopped the computer when I hit 400 calories and but I still went all the way around the block after that and, and spun out my legs which is to get all the lactic acid out of them because uh, I, I was pumping hard and I uh, so I, and I, when I pressed this off button, it stopped at 14 point, 
nine kilometers, so it's almost 15 kilometers round trip. Anyway, so uh, that was good. Like I said, now I'm uh, off to pick up Maggie, I'm gonna drop her off, and then I'm gonna go rock climbing with Paul. It'll be interesting to know, I wasn't gonna go, I usually don't cycle on the same day I, I rock climb, but I said, you know what? It's possibly gonna rain tomorrow too, and I won't be able to get out tomorrow, so I'm going to do my bike ride today and climb and see how I do climbing. I might actually have built up an energy to be a better climber today, but uh, I gotta keep riding and try to watch what I eat. All right, guys, let's pick up Megan. Picked up Megan and I'm off to Paul's house, grab some grub and then go rock climbing. Just have to wait for this choo-choo. Nice. That's the GO train. That's the only train that goes through this area and uses these rails. Uh, they, I can't remember what year they uh, reinstated the, the rail, but uh, freight trains used to use this a long time ago. And uh, then they went dead for a while. And then I guess um, GO train purchased them or the government purchased them. And uh, now I think I think it's four trains in the morning and four trains at night. If you guys live in Enbear and you take the GO train, let me know in the comments below uh, how many trains leave Barry every day. Cool? Cool. All right, where we are here. Hey, Paul, how you doing? Good, how are you doing? All right. How's what dinner? What, what like, did we eat whoa. for dinner? Tell me. Tell, tell the, he said it was your piece de resistance. It's a magical surprise. <laughs> what was it? It was scallops, rice, and a curry sauce with uh, Cilantro, garlic, had broccoli in it. That's why it was so delicious. And then for dessert, and then we put sriracha sauce on top. And then for dessert, we finish off the kids' pancakes and bacon. <laughs> so we really we're, need this. Now we're going rock climb. climbing. We might not be able to rock climb now. Oh, I feel heavy. I feel heavier. Yes, we are heavy. Oh boy. Okay, we're all finished rock climbing. We did our 10 climbs. I think Paul did 11. I, I, think, I think you did the bonus climb. I did the bonus climb. But that is only because you did so poorly. I did not pour any climb. <laughs> <laughs> um, I smashed Matt on the last climb. I, I did not smash I did a move and I went up and I was I went to pull up as opposed to looking before I went and I got like a, a nice dent a in my head. A lot, as long as I didn't split it open, which would cause havoc with the whole shaving thing. No good. Anyway, we're all back, going back to Paul's house to book our hotel, which is already booked. We're seeing if we can get a cheaper one through our amazing friend, Earl, uh, who seems to know some people in the hotel industry. So we're going to uh, see if what he can get for us is closer than where we are, which will be ultimate. Although the spot that we're staying at has some really cool restaurants. In this right walking right, distance. Yeah. So I think there's a jack and not that they're cool for that area. It's just that they're restaurants that we don't have up here. So I think it's, there's a Waffle House. I haven't done Waffle House in like six years. And um, Jack in the Box. I've never eaten at a Waffle House. And Paul's never eaten at a Waffle House. You must've heard that. <laughs> But uh, we'll get a Paul a waffle because they make really good waffles. I used to always get two when I was younger, but I'm, now I'm older. Unless I'm on my diet. I'm, I'm older and heavier, so I only go for the one waffle nowadays. But people put stuff all over it. And I was like, no way. Those just straight waffle with their whipped butter. It's like soft. It's almost like um, whip. Cool Whip kind of thing, right? And uh, so you put that all over it, and then their, their syrup is really good. That's the coronary special. <laughs> that is the coronary special. We're gonna uh, roll it up, liquefy it, and inject it into our veins. Oh yeah. All right, off to Paul's house. Ninja. Ooh. All right, guys, just uh, filling in on the rest of the evening. Uh, Paul and I looked up all the different hotels and discovered that the deal he got was just right for us. So, Earl, I'm going to pass on this one, but thank you very much. Uh, and then I came home. I probably got home like at around 10, 30, 11 o'clock. So I just... Uh, kicked back and watched my second last episode of Mayday, which is the one where they landed 
uh, in the Hudson in uh, New York City, and they saved everybody on that plane, which is a good one of those good crash stories. Um, and it was nobody's fault except the fact that they flew into a bunch of Canadian geese and that wrecked the engines, and that's why they had to crash. Um, so let's do happy birthday shoutouts. And now it's time for happy birthday shout out. We got a whole bunch of people. We got Michael, Thomas, Dave, the drum major, uh, Atel, Alan, Jesus, I can't believe it, that's great. Uh, Lucas, Mika, Josh, Hora, uh, Arian, and Isaac. I think I said that right. All right, guys, happy birthday. Don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below as to what you ate for your birthday dinner, if you ate in or if you ate out. Have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye.